My name is Erland Hagman. I was born in Sweden, where I uh, grew up. My life started as a major challenge. I had to fend for myself at a very early age. And I clearly recall as a youngster, age about 10, I started working in a factory to earn enough money, afford to buy a bike, so I didn't have to walk back and forth. Throughout my entire teens, I was balancing working in a factory and attending school. At the age of 28, I ventured over to the United States as I felt I wanted to write programming code in Silicon Valley. After a few years out there, I was given an opportunity at the new ABB operation in New York. And it was during those years in New York that I earned my MBA and later on followed by a PhD. Naturally, this educational base has allowed me to create my own path that has uh, successfully uh, made me an inventor, entrepreneur, as well as a businessman. How I first became involved with Western Connecticut State University was following my oldest daughter's sudden and tragic death some 15 years ago. At that time, the president, Dr. Smarter, but others at the university expressed to me and my family a genuine care and concern that hit the core. I realized the warmth, the caring, and the compassion that existed at the university and what my daughter had shared with us as a parents that she had ex experienced being a student here. Western Connecticut State University is unique that attracts many students of first generation uh, graduates. And all this struck a very strong chord with me as it in many ways has brought me back to where I started in life. Many students are in the unfortunate situation to have to balance work school and family uh, issues. And now we have other uh, local financial uh, contrib contributors that are adding to the pot. And we have to remember that all of this is helping the students at Western. Would it not be great if we were able to have students at Western finish their four years debt free? The state is not in the best of uh, financial situation and I don't see it changing rapidly. So outside help is need needed more today than ever before.